All right, turns out that I stand corrected. I can actually do two more of the parts of, of these uh, let's uh, plays uh, that are ahead. So I'm gonna gonna use them now. So previously left off doing the coastal remains on the seventh episode. This and this is going to be doing the uh, Neptune boss fight and also doing the rest of it on the eighth eighth episode. If I can finish the whole uh, whole fight, then. I want to make sure that I did, do not go over the, the, the memory of, uh, that my phone has, because it is limited, as any other phone. Alright, the boss fight with Neptune begins here. I'm not sure how much that I'll be able to do that. And here's her weakness. Her stomach is her weakness. Charging into it would allow her to be damaged. And that's how it, how it goes. Now there are there are there's gonna be something that's gonna shoot that's gonna throw lasers around the battlefield a little here, so find a, a way to dodge it by getting on top of it and whatever. And here is a glitch that's in the game that actually allows you to survive while windshielding under the toxic water. Which is really weird because Spiral could still be able to breathe in uh, on that water even uh, with being in the windshield like that. Oh boy. Gotta watch out for the, the to toxic balls that, that are trying to the fire. I still once again apologize for that uh, that um, triple death that I had on the 23rd part of my Let's Play. It plays a, a Spiral Hero's Tale. I didn't expect to have to die that many times. I guess I guess I wasn't paying any attention, uh, uh, and my timing was off. This may look like that it's not quite really perfectly straight, however, once, once the video is taken care of, it actually slightly uh, corrects uh, for, for all that stuff that happens. Alright, round one is all set here for this boss fight. Second half here now. Now there's going to be two uh, um, lasers that are going to try to um, hit Spyro now. Hit me. Well, Spyro's the play. Yep, now there's two of these now. I'll shoot. Okay, careful. There is a bar fly there, but uh, Sparks has not gotten attacked yet. However, falling in toxic water is an instant death, so definitely make sure that uh, make sure that it doesn't happen there on that. Oh boy, that's a that was a big one. Those big toxic balls kind of come uh, um, at, at you real fast. You gotta make sure that you don't get too close to her when she sends the, sends it. Otherwise, chances of dodging will decrease. The second half of the boss fight is almost taken care of here. Oh boy. Yeah, figures. Well, now I can grab that butterfly and get back to full health again. Oh boy. Oh, I'm nuts. I got attacked this time. Well, the second half of the boss fight is taken care of here. 
Now that has drained so much that pretty much they get, uh, well, that's now at the very bottom now of uh, uh, where this, this uh, toxic pool was. Normally you can't hear uh, those things going unless you go all the way to the very bottom upon like swimming like on water to down this low. The water will be brought back up again though once uh, uh, the next ferry is freed up. Yep, that's the bottom right there. Alright, it's going to get real serious here now. There's going to be a very big, a, a, a bunch of, a, of those, a, a bunch of those laser things on top of each other. One of them would be, would be that big. Oh, whatever. I guess it can um, end it getting it attacked early that way. Spark still has plenty of health, though. As long as it doesn't fall in the toxic water, this is not in jeopardy. Alright, and Neptune is full, officially defeated. And what's still two minutes of the part of despair? Now the next ferry is now freed, which is Aqua. Water breath is now able to be available. Yep, now that water wheel that's in the beach area can now be able to be uh, uh, be able to be activated and get that light gem that had to left behind for a while. And yeah, there's uh, there's the entire pool here. It would be a waste of time to swim that, that, uh, that down to the bottom there, so just move on. Wrong way. I know I'm going the wrong way here, yeah. There, this is the right way here. Standard water breath cannot defeat enemies, it can only be used to hold them back. Water breath can also be used to activate things. Press the right directional button to select water breath, press the left directional button to revert back to standard flame breath. And now the professor's next generator is now officially activated, allowing access to the next round, the third one, which is Icy Wilderness. Which also is a location of getting the wall kick ability. And one of the levels on that realm, of course. Alright, I'm going to stop as soon as I get out right out. Actually, I will go to the beach area get, and get Zoe to zap me there, and then that will be, uh, be it. No point in dealing with those guys. Uh, uh, no point in doing it any time. All right. Thank you for watching the whole uh, boss fight of Neptune and Neptune, and the next part will feature doing the rest of the coastal remains and also going to the icy wilderness, uh, which is the third round. Signing off.